Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of the new save file. We are jumping in once again and we'll see who we end up randomizing to start off with here. Basic Maggie? Have we? We did Basic Maggie kind of recently. Um, do you know what? Without, let, let's not randomize. Let's just look for a vanilla character that we haven't got a lot done with. Uh, Jake Vanese out, obviously. Uh, Bethany the Forgotten. Apollyon? To be fair, Apollyon we've done like nothing as. Um... We've not done tons of as Lazarus either. Um, I guess let's go as Apollyon. Yeah, we just haven't done a ton as Apollyon. There's a lot to, uh, to to get going. I think we already have um, <clears throat> Tainted Apollyon unlocked, right? I'm pretty sure. Can't remember. I can't remember. Anyways, we haven't played as regular Apollyon in a while. Also, I do apologise if this episode is, has slightly more lacking commentary than is usual. I am a bit hungover. Um, I'm hoping I'll be okay for the episode, but basically, yeah. And uh, my friend is moving away, um, like, in the next few days, and so he had, like, a leaving due. Um, we all, like, went to the pub and he invited a bunch of friends and stuff, and it was, like, a really big group of us, actually, like, um, it ended up being, like, sort of, like, 30-odd people. Um, hmm... Which means, yeah, I, I ended up drinking quite a lot. I, I guess we could take in free lemonade, but doesn't seem all that useful. <laughs> Unfortunate to get that off the bat. I, I, I'm i always like, oh, that was pretty nice. I'm always like a little bit at a loss when it comes to, um, oh, hello. Do you know what? I will go for this. I um, was hoping to get some HP back out of at least one of those. Sadly not. Um... Yeah, so I'm just definitely a wee, wee little bit hungover. Just a wee little bit. Oh, hello. Explosions going off like crazy. My goodness, my goodness. Oh, there you go. Okay. Uh, if I can fill up this burn heart, I'll definitely go back for more with uh, with those spike chests. I, I do actually like spike chests because, I mean, for one, they, they, they can give good stuff. They're just basically the same as grey chests. But also, I have a mod that is um, of my conception that means that you can get um, on-hit effect items from spiked chests, so it's kind of worth opening them for the potential chance of extra items. Um, wait, no, we're going to take this one first, and then this, so that we get a mini Isaac as well. Right, let's go back, open up this bad boy, we get bag lunch, you can also, you can also get these as well. Um, good, good. You see, that, like, literally paid out straight away, what the hell. And we get the poop from that as well, wow, okay. Poop, not great. <laughs> poop is not really what we want, but there you go. That works out pretty well. I can't believe we, th th there was a 2% chance on hit. 2% to get the uh, HP up. And we got it on our second hit. <laughs> it's kind of crazy. I don't think I've ever actually had the bag lunch pay out before. I think that's my first ever time. Getting it paid out. So that was pretty darn lucky. That was pretty darn lucky. But yeah, it's like difficult with the with the active to like know when to um when to use it for combat sort of thing. I'm I'm, I'm always unsure. Um, we've not seen our item room yet either. Oh no, we have. We've got free lemonade, of course. Um, oh, really, this guy? Did you have to? Did you have to? Did you have to with this guy? You get out of here as well. Oh my god. Constantly forgetting how this boss works. Don't do a little bonk attack on me, please. But yeah, as for the question of the day, just because I am a bit hungover, when was you last hungover? How was it? <laughs> how did you deal with it? Do you have any specific remedies? Oh my fucking life, this boss. Fuck off. Stop being the worst boss ever, please. <laughs> oh god, they're just gross. <laughs> I feel so bad because I, I I so highly respect the effort that went into like the style of this boss and like he's really cool. It's pretty well themed for Isaac, I think, but it just ugh, it just plays like shit. <laughs> just don't enjoy getting a Fiendfolia boss ever. <laughs> there you go. At least he's weak. But the corn I will definitely suck up. Unfortunately, not. Not really the best there, uh, but we'll keep going. Yeah, that was a shame. Lost our burn heart for little to no reason. Tis what it is. I'm going to go in here as well. Be oh, beautiful, yeah. 
beautiful. Can this spider die, please? There you go. Uh, to be fair, I didn't actually need to kill that. I could have just left. But yeah, good health now. Good health. I like it. I like it. But yeah, I'm not like I'm not like ridiculously bad in terms of hangover, but it's just you knowing you just you just feel a bit groggy. Like you just feel a, li a little bit like I don't know under the weather is there is is under the weather the right word probably not. Okay, nice. Managed to deal with those guys quickly and easily. And you as well. Ha ha ha. But yeah, what am I hoping for in terms of actives here? What could be good? What could be good? Oh god. Oh, really? Okay, thank god I've got soul, uh, soul hearts going for me right now, because that was a very, very stupid, stupid way to lose HP there. If I'd have lost my devil deal to that, I don't know if I'd be forgiving myself so easily. I don't think I would have been. Right, take care of these little fellas. Oh, but yeah, I guess so. So I'm just a little bit, little bit groggy today. But at the same time, I, uh, I, I, as I've said recently, at the minute I've just got like no Isaac backlog, which is uh, meaning that I'm basically like having to do Isaac episodes day to day, uh, which means that when I'm hungover, I have to do the episodes still. Because to be fair, I, I, I said, oh really? You hit me? Why did you hit me? Um, I say it like it's a chore. It's not. I do enjoy these videos regardless. It's just like not the most ideal circumstance. I could wait until later in the day. It's, it is like 12 p.m. right now. But um, I, I thought, nah, I'll just, I'll just do it now. Because it's kind of like a chill way to wake myself up a little bit as well, playing Isaac. I've always said that before. Like Sometimes I'll like record my episodes before like I start work. It's just kind of a way to get my to get my brain working. Do you know how like some people do like crosswords and stuff to like wake themselves up in the morning? It, it, for me, Isaac's like a pretty good way to like wake myself up. Do, do you know what? I'm I'm not even gonna bother killing you guys because you're gonna be pains in the asses. I'm just gonna destroy the other poop so you fly away. It's way way easier for me. Way way easier. Oh god. Oh god. I'm not liking the sheer amount of potential enemies we've got going on here. Don't throw your head at me, big fella. I like the way they chase down the other heads. No thank you for you, no thank you for you. And you two can kill each other. And they'll get you as well. Right, I'm gonna try and do my devil deal, uh, get my devil deal here, but unfortunately I've lost my, uh... I've lost my protection now, so... I'm not as convinced as I once would have been. Not as convinced. I want to use a bomb on this guy, but it's just like, he's just going to move. So it's like, is it worth it? Is it worth it, really? I really like the design of this boss. When, when was this boss added? Was this boss added with um, Afterbirth, Afterbirth Plus? So I don't think this was vanilla game, was it? I don't think this was in the base game. To be fair, like the content additions in terms of, like the bosses and stuff they added with the uh, like afterbirth and, and stuff were actually pretty good. I think the only thing they really missed the mark with was the void, and then like afterbirth plus got kind of shit on just because it uh, introduced a lot of issues. But I don't know, it was it it was fun to sort of play Isaac as the DLC released. I'm glad that I got in sort of as like on the ground floor, as you'd say. Um, I will definitely take false PhD here. Um, I would very much like false PhD. And yeah, I'll take a look down for a damage up. Most certainly. I'll also do that as well. I think I got... Did I get another damage up then? What was the other stat that I got? I don't know. Whatever, whatever. It's fine. I'd like some more uh, keys, please, because then I can go to my shop. See what we can do there. Just keep it moving. Oh, God, we got some, some jumpy hippity hot boys. God damn, that's a lot of them. That's a lot of them. Oh, my God. Oh my god, I didn't realise there were so many of them. Holy shit. Are you the fly guy, or are you the... Okay, no, you were... I was wondering which uh, champion style that was then. I wasn't really sure. This is... Hmm. This is kind of rough, because I very much want that. That's a very good item. But at the same time, like... Hmm, why a secret room then? 
here, I guess. What? What secret room? I am confusion. Right, I'm. I'm. I'm I don't know. I'm. I'm genuinely tempted to just give up Void. This is why. This is why Apollyon doesn't. I don't know. As a character, I don't think he really works very well. Cause like you have to stick with your. You feel like you're obligated to stick with the active. And then yeah, like the the whole sucking up actives thing just doesn't really work very well. Not really the way it should. Um, cause I really want that. It's really good. Turns the room gold. Um, affects enemies. Yeah, like I'm. I'm just gonna take that. It's 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 way more fun. <laughs> like I'm sorry, but this item's way more fun. Um, I'll wait until we get into another room for it. And we'll just go down. I am sorry to leave you, Void. I know that it's literally invalidating the entire point of this character's niche. But at the same time, it's way more fun to, to just play around with the, uh, the Golden God. Good. That, and we got a key straight away as well, which I love. Probably use it in this room if there's a good amount of rocks. <clears throat> of course, there is no rocks. Why do you troll me, sir? Again, why do you troll me, sir? Kind of hating the rooms that we've got, we've been given so far. I do not like fighting these maggot things, especially not with our low damage right now. We have pretty iffy damage, but false PhD should hopefully sort that out pretty quick. I feel like yeah, my fire is letting me down as well. Feels very very low. But yeah, I was really hoping this would be a big room full of enemies, full of um, full of rocks. So we can get a bunch of fool's gold rocks. It's like, no, no, no. None. Not a single, not another single rock. Okay, good, good. I mean, yeah, I guess. Dude, where art thou, where art thou rocks? You're doing that. Okay, good. Are you gonna jump? Yes, you are. God damn, those enemies can be brutal. Turn my pennies into golden pennies. Would that work? I just not, not had a good enough room for it yet. I feel so weak right now. I don't know. Just, just this run feels like it's not got much going on for it yet. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, we did, we did uh, get like not great stuff early on. Hey, we got a key for our shop now. Good, good. Dude, where the fuck's all the rooms with, like, tons of rocks? I swear you see tons of them, and then as soon as you want them, it's like, nah. No thanks. There'll be no more of those. Money, 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 money. Oh, dude, this is getting frustrating now. And also, we got a crab room. No one likes crabs. No one likes crabs. Oh, for fuck's sake. There's more? Why? Why would any sane human create a room with this many crabs? Goddamn hate crabs. Dude! This floor sucks ass for this active. Where the fuck are all the rocks? <laughs> oh, you goddamn hit me as well. I don't think I've ever been hit by one of those enemies. I don't know, this, this run feels rough, man. This run feels real rough. Like, how do we only have two passives? At, like this late into the game. I am not taking that yet. Right, if this next room doesn't have a fuck ton of rocks in it, I'm actually gonna cry a little bit. This has been truly depressy spaghetti. Let's go, go, go. Okay, finally. A good fucking room for this. Oh, bloody hell. Holy shit, I didn't expect him to move at that sort of speed. Fuck you. Fuck you. Dude, what the hell? This guy's insane. Stop. Die. Oh my god. Oh, I feel so weak right now. Dude, this enemy. Fuck that. Lost my devil deal to that bullshit. God damn it. I'm a bit miffed. Yeah, 
Come in here real quick. Chance to shoot green fires which explode. Ooh, very, very nice. And yeah, you can see now we've just got fool's gold rocks all over the darn place. We definitely need more bombs at the present time. Still, this was a good amount of money to get from that room there. Right, these fires better be fast and loose, because we really need a pretty large DPS increase, like, right the fuck now. I'm also going to take a range down for a damager. Ah, for God's sake. My damage feels piss poor. Oh my God. Things ain't going our way here, people. Things ain't going our way. You you get out of here too. No one no one no one asked for your business. But these champions are just brutal for me. Oh, I got that missed. Okay, there you go. It, 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 eventually, at least. Right, please shop. Be good. We got all this money for a reason. Um, could be good. That was pretty worthwhile. That was pretty worthwhile. I'm happy. I'm happy. Okay. I don't know if the dad's thing will work. With, uh, nah, unfortunately, that dad's battery doesn't even work with this active, so that's a bit sad. I was kind of hoping it would. I'd be able to just overuse my uh, active. Crosshatch eye boys. Whatever you want to call them. Grimaces things. How long does the fire stay there for, then? Ugh, this room, this room's also pretty gross. And it's boss time. Goddamn cube of meat boss as well. Not good stuff. Li literally, this run has been a bit fat dookie, I'll be honest. Apollyon, you have let me down on this day. What is this boss doing also? Get the fuck out the corner. Come, come, come do something. Yeah, just get the bloody, ugh, gross corn kernel in. I'll be honest, do I even want to continue this run? This run is ass. This run is so ass. Like, the, the Naga Chili and the, the, the um, like the, the PhD and stuff, the, 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 the false PhD and stuff, they're pretty good, but I don't know, my, my stats just feel really bad. I feel like I'm killing stuff really slowly. I feel like I've got no, not really got anything interesting happening. It's just, yeah. I don't want to be the person that complains the whole run, but you feel me, right? Like, why did... So, not only they had to... Oh, my God. This run might be over in a minute. Um, not only did they feel the need to make the... Um, make the Fiend Folio bosses a nightmare to fight, but they also was like, hey, what if we made their item reward absolutely fucking terrible? <laughs> what if we made a guaranteed of getting the corn kernel and it's absolutely awful? How, how about that? That'd be funny, right? Come on, now. You know that's not what I wanted. You know that's not what I wanted. I should really uh, drop my trinket before I use it next, because I think it has a chance to turn my trinket gold. I mean, that's pretty useful. Like, this is not a great trinket, but it's already activated twice on a 10% chance, so we up it to a 20% chance with it being gold. I don't know. Could be pretty useful. Could be pretty useful. What we need is we need a hell of a lot more luck. If we can get our Naga Chili just firing like crazy. That would be awesome. If we can just have our Naga Chili popping off. But it's, at the minute, it's not really firing all that much. There you go, we got one there. Oh, there, okay. okay. I, I complained and it was like, I hear you, I hear you. I see what you're putting down. But yeah, the more luck we can get, the better. I did already take a look down, which is kind of stupid of me, but I didn't know I was going to get this item at the point, so don't sue me. Okay. Take care of Squid Boy. Really? Come on now. Oh, bloody hell. I used a bomb a little bit too late there. 
Steam sale's good, I guess, but we thought we, we've got enough money to afford things normally, so it's not like a necessity. And also, it's like fine if I'm actually getting shops, which at the minute I'm not. Damn it, I was kind of hoping I could get it in his mouth there, right as the fight started, but I don't know if it actually works. I've never, I don't think I've ever actually managed to get a bomb in his mouth in time. Because you can do like, you know, the chub dislike smoke thing. You can do that with this guy. I don't think a lot of people know that. But, um, I think it's if you do it like right as, he's not doing the opening mouth move actually, but there's a, there is a bit where he opens his mouth. There you go, I got it, I did it. Ha ha ha. You see? He swallowed the bomb. And it stuns him for a really long time. Look at that. We did it. Never been done before. Never seen before. Okay, that's a good damager. Let's keep moving on. Hopefully, I'm really hoping we get a half decent shop next and we can buy some good stuff. I want a shop with like a reroll machine so I can buy a good few things. It's not very useful, is it that? Oh, for fuck's sake. Just lost my devil deal straight away. This run, man. This run. It's giving me every sort of will in the world to just hate it. Well done, sir. Well done, what a move. <laughs> Put himself straight into those spikes. Good, good. Oh, really? Nah. Nope. Don't even, like, I don't have to pass through that room. I do not care at all to spend ages with your little puzzle. No, thank you. I will waste a bomb to leave that straight away. Right, so let, let, next time we use our active here, let's make sure to drop our trinket. Good. Not really found the right room for it yet. Still not found the right room for it. Come on now. Oh, they changed these guys a little bit. Like, stick to walls a little bit now. It's kind of cool. Yeah, this is worth it. Quite a lot of bombs. Good for getting extra money. Okay, here's a, here's a big room, an L-shaped room. We can try and use it in there. My corn boy did save me then. Yeah, so let's drop the trinket and then do that. And it did indeed turn it into a gold trinket. Awesome. Man, what's going on with this? This is... Enemies are so hard to kill. Brutal. Die. We got there in the end. Emoji glasses. Why the hell not? Oh, I forgot the eternal heart on the last floor. I'm stupid. My bad, I guess. My bad indeed. <laughs> the emoji glasses are just so bizarre. You gotta love it. What a way to spice up the run, I guess. They all have, like, different effects and stuff. Some wacky stuff going on. I should knock them about with the boot. Give them the stanky boot. Good, good. Spider unboxing. Unfortunately, that doesn't do anything good for us. I don't think I've ever used Golden God against a boss. I don't know if it does anything for bosses. I wouldn't expect so. What do the presents do? Do they actually give me anything? Oh my god. <laughs> this is so hectic now. What the fuck did we do to this run? Okay, we need to go find our shop. We cannot leave without finding our shop. It's the whole reason we're making so much money. We need to be able to spend it somewhere. Bit of 
It's not here. Ooh, we got like an empowered one there. It must be over here. <laughs> uh, I just love vis visually that the Emerge Glasses is the only thing our character, like, has on them. I need to find out what, like, all the things do, because there's some pretty strong effects in the Emerge Glasses. Okay, we've actually got some good stuff here, so we'll take that. Then we'll uh, re-roll. We'll definitely take that. Don't know if it'll do anything for us, but I'll take it. We'll take the soul heart. Um, spawn new trinket. 40% chance to smell current trinket. 40% chance to spit out smelted trinket. 10% chance to re-roll your current trinket. I don't know, but I'm going to buy it and try it. Ah, I fucking got rid of my other trinket, of course. Okay. Pretty good stuff. Pretty cool active. I like it. Someone mentioned it in a previous episode and said it was really interesting. I have to give it a go, and so there you go. Oh, hello. Right. Secret room, reveal yourself. Right. Whereabouts could the secret room be? Probably up from here. Uh, it could be up from here or down from there. There you go. I like the Teddy Tears. There's wholly too many heady boys. Die, fool. I'm just gonna keep turning your friends into poo. Right. Back over this way. Oh, wait, no. Back over this way. Bloody hell. We're making our way eventually. Thank you. And I'm going to drop my trinket in the boss fight and then use my, uh, my thingy. I just want to see if it does anything to bosses. I don't think it will. But while we've got a golden charge, why not? Why not give it, give it a whack? In fact, like, this run's got a bit more interesting now, I'd say. Ah, oh, I didn't gold this trinket, sadly. Oh, it did give me... I, I don't know where this other trinket came from, but it did give me a, a golden um, telescope lens. I, I have literally no idea where the fuck that came from, but... I think I'm actually going to take this, you know. Um. Yes. Oh god, the dark, the dark emojis. <laughs> The dark emojis are here. Oh lord. Okay, down to the next floor. Yeah, it's pretty probably a pretty bad idea to leave that, but I like the idea of a really high chance for a planetarium. <laughs> Look at that dark crocodile and dark think emoji that's so funny. Sadly not what we wanted there.
Okay, all good. Okay, let's just try and stay alive now. Let's just try and stay alive. I think we've actually got a pretty good run going now. Golden penny in there as well. Don't think I need that. I'll play the golden penny a little bit, but I don't need to like go whole hog on it. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. Yeah, we are killing stuff at an impressive speed. Tends up being a run that I can respect. Daddy Longlegs is also pretty damn good. I like it, I love it, I want some more of it. My character also just looks hilarious now. I'm kind of loving how they look. Oh, really? That had to hit me. Come on, please do give me a planetarium this floor, or at least the next one. Otherwise, I'm going to have taken this trinket for no reason. But I think we have like a... It says we only have a 25% chance for a planetarium, but I, I don't actually know if it being gold is affecting that or not. It looks like maybe it isn't, which is kind of upsetting. I thought it would have doubled the chance, but maybe it's not. Which would be a real shame. But still, I'm sticking with it. I need to stop standing so close to enemies because them explosions are going to hurt me. And I do not have the health to spend. I really do not. So focused. Look at all these crocodiles. Oh my god. I love the fact that Dark Matt has made them all like shadowy. That's so funny. Take whatever this is. Probably a decent idea. Wish I had more soul hearts to work with that, but God, remember when that thing had uh, infinite charges and was like broken as all shit? God damn. That active used to be so busted when Repentance came out. Won me quite a few runs, that bad boy did. Find it in the shop, you have like four soul hearts, and now you have a ton of HP. It's like, it was so good. Oh, bollocks. Right before the boss as well. God damn it. It's fine. It is what it is. Oh, really? That missed? Really hoping that bomb would be in time there, but sadly, it was not. Hoping I can get a Naga fire right in there as the eye pops out. There you go, that's exactly what I wanted. Didn't do a ton, but did, did a good amount. Where did this x lack liquid come from? Not a fan of that being around. Daddy Longlegs doing some business as well. Gotta love it. Hey, not so bad, not so bad. Take the Soul Heart. Take the Polaroid. Confusion's not really what I wanted here, but whatever. I'm going Omega Gamble. I'm going Omega Gamble. This run needs more power. I am taking all the risks. <laughs> it's a very, very big risk. I'll give you that. It's a very, very big risk, but... Oh, this run needs a little bit more oomph to it. You watch me kill myself with the Naga Chili. Don't know what to expect from these enemies here, so... We'll find another soul heart before we die, definitely. I'm very glad I used the uh, thingy in this room. I managed to make a poop there that wasn't a golden poop. Whoa! Okay, I don't know what killed me there, I'll be honest. Uh, but uh, did you see that my daddy long legs was golden? It distracted me. Well, that was a bit of a gamble. It was a little bit stupid. Either way, I hope you guys enjoyed, and yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one.